They won yesterday largely because Pat Dean in his first major league start found a way to control this very potent Toronto lineup. Darwin Barney the first batter and he fouls it away. Pat congratulations you did not get the win but the twins got the win and uh, thanks largely to a really good outing for you. Yeah thank you I appreciate it It was uh, a lot of fun to be a part of that and just want to get out there and, and do a job give the, the team a chance to win and luckily we were able to pull it out the end. Hey Pat Burp line up in here listen when you started yesterday I know you were probably very very nervous but did the outing here in your major league debut against the Orioles and then the five and a third innings that you pitched in Detroit help at all I definitely think so uh, getting that first first one out of the way against Baltimore against a really good lineup um, I know I gave up a couple runs but it still gave me a little bit of confidence to uh, go out there and get one under my belt and, and prove to myself that I, I can get guys out here and then that definitely that the outing I had in Detroit really added to that confidence level uh, against a really really tough lineup with a lot of guys that are some very good hitters so uh, I think that definitely helped to prepare me for uh, my start yesterday. Now, yesterday you gave up only three hits. I I, I say you only made, really made one mistake, and that was that ball to Batista. Did you try to get in a little bit further than you wanted? Uh, I, that I was mean, trying to, I'm sure that's what you wanted to do, get it in a little bit further. I was trying to get in with that slider, but I, I wanted to get it more of a closer to a back foot than uh, leave it up where I got where I left it. Uh, kind of got ahead of myself trying to do too much with that pitch with the guy on second base and uh, just leaked away and my uh, my arm kind of couldn't catch up left that ball up over the plate and you know he did what he does with it. RC catches a line drive. Hey Pat I want to ask you something because we talked about it both in your debut and then yesterday too that something apparently clicked for you last year your numbers at triple A were so much better than they had been at double A what's what's the reason for that. There's a couple of things that kind of went into it. Uh, I really struggled in double A lost my confidence and it really got to the point where I was just I would get out into the mountain and say OK you know what innings is going to fall apart this time and uh, it wasn't really a good feeling at all but when's the offseason my wife was a, a huge help with trying to get me back on the positive mental side really got she really got me to uh, get back to appreciating the game and, and enjoying myself and realizing that I'm lucky enough to be able to play this game for a living. Other line drive this time Arcia can't catch it and Pilar has an extra base hit the fourth extra base hit for the Jays first time through the order yeah, and everything has been hit in the air off of uh, Phil Hughes who's a fly ball pitcher but the Blue Jays right now getting the barrel of the bat against Phil Hughes but you no know, Pat 140 minor league starts that helped you a lot too did yeah, yeah, definitely got some seasoning down there. <laughs> uh, learned a lot about myself as a pitcher, and uh, I think a big help too was playing winter ball in the Dominican, being able to talk to a lot of older guys on that team, and uh, and face some really, really good lineups. Uh, learning how to pitch inside has been a huge help for me. Pop up, short center field. Nunez out, Dozier out, and it is Nunez who makes a basket catch okay. for out number two. Hey, what was it like? Because you, through your whole professional career, you'd been uh, just a starting pitcher, and you know you, your first couple of outings, you had to come out of the bullpen. That had to be a unique experience for you. It was definitely a different experience, but the guys down there were a big help. Uh, Kinsler came, uh, got called the same day I did, so he kind of took me under his wing while I was in the bullpen. And any questions I had uh, about a routine and, and things like that, he was great with. Uh, so they definitely helped ease me into that uh, situation, and all I wanted to do was, all I wanted to do was uh, you know, take advantage of whatever opportunity was given to me, whether it's in the bullpen or in the rotation. I just wanted to be able to come up here and, and uh, contribute any way I can. Now your next start, I think, is going to be what Friday in Seattle, right? I believe so. Yep. And and you said that uh, growing up in Connecticut, you were a big Yankee fan. Mm -hmm. So you'll be pitching against Robinson Cano Friday night in Seattle. Oh yeah, uh, great hitter. And it was, I know a lot of the Yankee fans were kind of upset that that he left, but he's he's a great hitter and took advantage of a, a good situation for himself. So I'm excited to face him. Pat, we'll look forward to your next start. Thanks for All the right. time today. Thank you very much, guys. Success, Pat. I appreciate it.